Good morning. It's uh, 3.35 a.m. It's Friday. I'm on my way to the gym. Monday's Fridays. <clears throat> Two days that I like to make sure that I'm up earlier. I'm accomplishing more because I believe that those two days, I'll call them right now, I'll call them capstones, I'll call them anchors. I believe that those are the two days that are gonna dictate two different things. Monday's gonna dictate how your Monday through Friday goes. Friday is gonna dictate how your Saturday and Sunday goes. Those are the times I believe you need to be at your most productive and at your highest uh, way of alertness because you're gonna be able to get more out of your day, more out of your week, accomplish your goals, and uh, really get to the point that you want to be at. And, and, and everything that I'm telling you are things that I'm actually exercising, things that I'm actually doing. I'm actually in my car uh, at 3.30 in the morning. I'm actually up at 2.05 in the morning. If you ever see my wife ask her these things, does Jermaine really do the stuff that he says he does? Is he really committed the way he says he's committed? And the answer would be yes. The other thing I'm committed to is keeping these videos a little bit shorter because... Well, the fact of the matter is I get tired of hearing myself talk. One thing I do know is that the more I commit, the more I stay uh, learning, educating, the more I stay believing, the more that I feel more comfortable with selecting the people that I choose to uh, mingle with, the people I choose to do business with. I'm more selective about the people that I allow into my life. I'm more comfortable with being me in order to make sure that I attract like-minded or like people. That's not good. That's not bad. That's, that doesn't put me on a level up here and everybody else down here. No, that just means that I'm me. So if I'm 6'1", I want to look straight at you because you're 6'1". Makes sense? I don't want to look down. I don't want to look up. I just want to deal with people who are like-minded to myself. And what I found is, is that I don't mind dismissing some business. I don't mind taking some other business. There's certain business that I'll say, you know what? Mm, no, I don't think so. There's certain people I don't engage conversations with. I don't care what it is. If I see that you like to run around and talk to everybody and, and you're kind of loose with how you do things and, yeah, you, 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 you know, you're, 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 you know, you may like to gossip a little bit. There's certain things that I'm just not going to allow inside myself. There's certain things I'm not going to allow my day to be a part of. There's certain things I'm not going to expose my mind and my, my faith to. There's just certain things because they don't fall in line with what I want out of life. They don't. And to this point, everything has been stacking up really well. And, and I'm not you know, necessarily in a good or jovial mood because everything is going good. Uh, because I've been like this at times when things were going 100% bad. Uh, it's all perception. You have to know that sometimes being inside the fire, well, we know that fire sharpens and fire strengthens steels. It takes out all the imperfections of the steel in order to make it one of the toughest surfaces or toughest uh, raw materials on the face of this earth. So sometimes being in the fire is just a, just a time for you to kind of reflect be thankful for what you've had, what you're having now, and what you're going to have in the future. I always thank God, not for just what he's brought me through or what I'm going through right now, but what he's going to be doing in my life. So the fact of the matter is that sometimes being in that fire is exactly where you need to be. And sometimes reveling in that moment is, is exactly where you need to be. So keep it short. Monday, Friday is very important. If one thing I want to always do is push myself to go a little bit harder uh, when I know that my competition is typically going to slow down a little bit more. And uh, it works for me. So I'm going to keep it at that. God bless. Take care. Friday. Have a great day.